Shane, that was a really tricky race. Two, two pit stops for you guys too, and you still yeah. come out on top. Yeah, it was, it was about strategy. Could have gone either way, so i um, glad the boys called me in. And, and, and no doubt, we got out there in wets, and there was, a, there was a dry line right from the start. So we were saved a little bit by just a, a bunch of safety car laps, and we made the call to come in and got onto the back of the train, and that was just enough to hand the car over to Nick, and he did a great job from there. Nick, you had to pass a lot of cars and then you had to hold, hold off a bloke at the end who was pretty determined. Yeah, we, um, yeah, like Shane said, we were last when we came out the pits and somehow really good outlap and I um, closed off in the back of Shane. I think that gave us a lot of track position and then from then on it was about um, sort of strategic moves because um, a bit of blocking happening and uh, ran up in a bit of a different spot. We wouldn't be expected to pass there and um, then knew I had to get uh, Bairdo's car straight away too. So had a bit of a risk down the inside in the water but it all paid off and I knew McLaughlin was coming because I saw him coming as we were exiting turn two. I looked in the mirror I'm like, there he is. It's going to be on again. So it was an um, awesome battle. Saved some tyre and then uh, had a bit of a... Right at the end, so it was good race.